Survivors lived through the trauma of Route 91. Our veterans that served our country went through war. Now some of them are asking for change at the state capitol, more mental health research, and a chance to participate in experiments using mushrooms and MDMA. It really is a rough road. The one year anniversary, I kind of fell apart. But I also have a lot of tools at my disposal. Five years ago, we spoke to Joseph Astunio of the Route 91 Foundation. He and so many other Route 91 survivors across the country were desperate for mental health help and treatment. And in their search for options, they came across medical experiments using MDMA, a party drug that's illegal for recreational use. Now, five years later, lawmakers in the legislature could open the door for Nevadans to try a treatment that's gaining traction. The more tools that we have access to, shooting survivors, veterans, like the the better off we are. I, I don't think there is a state probably that isn't considering legislation and it isn't looking at this as a real possibility. And I think we should be on the forefront of that research and that innovation here in our state. State Senator Rochelle Wynn authored Senate Bill 242 that would allow medical tests using MDMA and psilocybin or psychedelic mushrooms. She says some medical experts at UNLV are eager to start advanced research, while veterans in need have asked her for a chance to try a new treatment. Last year, the FDA recently expanded MDMA trials in 10 states after promising results and gave the green light to phase three clinical trials of psilocybin for depression. Numerous states, such as California, Arizona, Utah, Hawaii, and Texas are working on policies for medical use. And I really wish that you know lawmakers would take that into consideration, survivors and like the stuff we have to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. The bill will be heard next Thursday in committee. Senator Wynn is also working on another language in the bill that could give doctors the ability to issue prescriptions or use by Native Americans for religious purposes.